Hello, peepals. Welcome back to Jordan 54's Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga walkthrough. In the last episode, we, like, took a million years. <laughs> because, uh, the last episode was so long. Uh, 23 minutes and 42 seconds, to be exact. We did a barrel maze, had a battle with Rookie and Popple, and learned two new hammer techniques. That's pretty awesome. Right. Now we're done with Chateau de Chucklehuck, and now we're in Chucklehuck Woods, which has almost the same music. See? Like, it's... It's pretty awesome music, actually. It's pretty catchy. I like it. Let's see. What do we have here? Uh, mushroom? Called it! New enemy. Pest nuts. I hate these things. They're another enemy that turns into a, a normal beanie after they get KO'd. Now, as we all know, <laughs> as soon as you learn a new hammer, as soon as you knew... I can't talk today. Huh. As soon as you learn a new brother's technique, you learn a new brother's attack. Chopper bros for Mario, knockback for Luigi. That was horrible, but it was enough to kill the beanies, so I'm not complaining. That's one of the pest nuts attacks. Its other attack is it'll go off the screen this way, and it'll come back here. The way you can tell which bro is attacking is, say it's here and it goes up, it's attacking Mario, but if it just goes straight, Luigi. If it's up here and it goes down, that's Luigi. If it's straight, it goes to Mario. You can also tell if it's ever in the middle, because sometimes they do that when there's three. And it always goes in one direction, and you can tell. So, I love these new hammer techniques, too. They're probably the strongest attacks in the game, believe it or not. And uh, especially knockback bros. It can do a ton of damage with the advanced command. Oh my god, it's a gold beanie. No! Oh, it ran. Those things give you a ton of coins and a spike badge, which allows you to do double damage to spike foes with any attack. Speaking of double damage to spike foes, why didn't I use splash bros? I must be stupid. I mean, I am stupid to misplace my Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga cartridge for like three, four days. I don't know. <laughs> now, look at these pest nuts when you at, uh, cause that first strike on them. Their eyes are like all over the place. <laughs> They're crazy. Now, let's do some serious damage here. Ugh, 64. See, it went up, so it's attacking Mario. Sometimes you can accidentally land on the pest nuts uh, by accident, and instead of the normal uh, "you got hit" animation, they'll like they'll like bounce on their leg. It's pretty funny. I did that once, and I couldn't stop laughing. I kept doing it again and again on purpose because it was so funny. Two Splash Brothers in this guy. I hate pest nuts, they're so annoying. Ah, oh, miss. The cool thing is, if you miss on that uh, command in the Brothers attack, you can still do double damage. By the way, uh, I haven't tried this in a while, so. That's what I get. I was trying to do the advance command so I could. Really? I was trying to do the advance command so, um. I could hit two beanies at the same time, but guess that wasn't a good idea. Oh well, Mario levels up. Probably because he never leveled up in um, the rookie and popple battle. <laughs> it was pitiful. All right, level 12, up his stash. Oh, all one. So much for getting a lot of lucky hits. Ooh, Luigi levels up too. Give him some defense. Be something good. 
Three. That's good. I like it. Now these pest nuts randomly spawn from these trees. Uh, you see, you can tell when there's a bean on the tree that just doesn't look uh, like it belongs. Now, I just realized something. Right... I'm putting my trying to put my finger on the camera's lens so you can no, that's not a good idea. <laughs> Those two leaves right there. Like in between my fingers. On the camera, it looks like the head of a Yoshi, almost. Just it's something random that I saw. And the the bean that's directly below those leaves, that's a pest nut. See? Whenever there's a bean that looks like it doesn't belong. It's gonna be a pest nut. So, prepare your failed first strikes. Like me. Well, that was terrible. Let's do this. Uh! Yes, another gold beanie. Oh, <laughs> see, that's what happens when you uh, get hit when you land on it. No. Uh, these gold beanies, they have quite a bit more HP than um, other beanies and if you let them attack they'll run away or if you're really lucky they'll attack you at double the speed that beanies will so we have to destroy this thing before it gets a chance to run away so knockback bros because that does a lot of damage 30 all right and I need to take a break so I can delete some more film to get room for the rest of this part, because this part's going to be long, too. See you in a second. All right. I am back. That didn't take very long. So, now that all taken care of, let's take care of these other pest nuts. Almost called it a sunflower. It does look like an evil sunflower that's ugly, though. Once there was an ugly sunflower. He was so ugly that everyone died. The end. Wow. That was a really loud sound effect for that. It was like... Phew. Usually it's not that loud. I think the sound emulator on my Game Boy Advance just, like, got thrown off. Now, notice how I said sound emulator? Not using an emulator. See? It's legit. Got my real Game Boy Advance here. At SP. Alright. So we got ourselves a spike badge. And I already explained what that does. It does double damage to spiked enemies. And since Luigi doesn't have a badge yet, let's give it to him. By the way, it also ups his power too. As an added bonus. Uh, before we go there, let's go here. <laughs> it sounds like I any everything I'd ever say in a walkthrough. Before we go there, let's go here. Anyways, Q double speed. Another gold beanie? Huh. Why not get another spike badge? I mean, you can sell them at stores for a good price. Ah. Always gotta, uh, always gotta be prepared for those multiple coin blocks. That way, I won't waste coins. Here's another one of those green pipes. It's number five. Jeez, wouldn't allow me to go back. It wanted me to teleport to a different spot. Um, I'm missing something. I feel like I am. I think I might have missed some chuckle bean spots. Uh, let me check. I'm trying to talk over everything so I don't get another third party content notice. Pfft. That was so annoying. I, I mean, uh, on one of my parts, I think it was part 22. Three, yeah, 23. 
Uh, I didn't talk for like three seconds and I got a third party content claim. It was so annoying. These are reason maps. Region maps. See, I can't talk today. It shows basically the maps of all the rooms and stuff. It's pretty useful. It's a pretty big place and uh, you see this slightly purple area that's lighter than all the others. That's basically the entrance to an area that we can't go yet. So these four spaces plus this weird snail shell thing uh, are going to be uh, places that we can't reach. Territory that we're not allowed entry in. Region maps are found pretty common around, place, uh, around places in the Bean Bean Kingdom. And they usually come at the most important times. Like whenever you're lost in an area, it'll give you a region map and be like, Hey, assistance! We know you need it, so here you go. You can save here, but first, let me show you why you can't go over there. It's a dirt turtle! Hate Dirt Koopas. They're so annoying. Uh, as I said before, they have a name. But let's just call them Dirt Koopa. Freshing Herb. Freshing Herbs uh, cure status ailments because you can get sick in this area. And uh, Refreshing Herbs can cure it because you'll take damage every time it's your turn. And nobody wants to do that. So. Let's save here. We're not in Chateau de Chucklehuck anymore. We're in Chucklehuck Woods Tiny Hole. Called it. I wonder if you get like a copyright claim for not talking over like a period of silence. That would be so funny. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's make Mario small so he can have a little, few adventures here. Hit that and the cave will... Well, the, not the cave, the cage will go. And you can come in here and get yourself some items. Syrup. Mushroom. Syrup. You have to make that cage disappear because it's steel flooring. Can't go through it. And, uh, oh, there's this spot. You stand on the mat, expecting to take another hilarious picture. Suddenly, fireball! Yeah. Poems of love. An empty barrel so like the heart of a man. Tunnel from below. How is that a poem of love? And how is that a poem? Anyway, what it's saying is, you make Luigi a mole, he jumps underneath the barrel, and now he's Barrel Man. Do a barrel roll. Fail. Luigi wins tennis. Love 15. Wait a minute. Love 15. Oh, that's why it's called Poems of Love. Alright. Oh boy, another pest nut. How did I fail that first strike? Jeez. Talk about annoying. I'm just getting all the gold beanies today. That's three spike badges in one go. Is this the right way? Because I don't want to go the right way. Let me check. Uh, no. This is the wrong way. Uh, no. Sorry, this is the right way. It's the wrong way for now. Alright, we got some more pest nuts. That was so annoying. All right. 
Hi, Luigi levels up. Again. Okay, how do we level up twice? Through a bunch of tiny... Th through a few tiny enemies. But not level up once during the Rookie and Popple battle. And we defeated both Rookie and Popple. Alright. Level 13, that's up its HP. Four! Yeah! Alright. Heh, <laughs> Mario doesn't level up. What? Yeah, around level 12, Mario starts needing more experience than Luigi to level up. It's so weird. Like, look, they have the same exact amount of experience. 1,902. Mario needs more experience to level up. Maybe that has something to do with Luigi's gear. I don't know. As you can see, this a dead end. It's like that time in Stardust Fields where there's this one thing and you can't jump up. And there's a, a weird bluish green tree branch up there that will probably get to the next part, if not the part after that. And there's another new enemy here. These are chuck guys. Because they chuck their spears at you sometimes. That was terrible. Jeez. <laughs> Luigi just got mauled by them. Let's restore his uh, BP because I don't like having one because then I can't use brother's attacks. Knock back. Woo! Uh. They have two attacks. There's the one where they shoot their... They don't shoot their spear at you. There's the one where they try to stab you with their spear. And there's another one where they try to just go through you and just maul and bum rush you. The way you can tell which one they're going to use is if they jump before they start moving. If they jump, then they're going to bum rush you. Let's take care of them. They have quite a bit of HP, so it's probably going to take you two hits. There you go, Mario. Level up like a man. Alright. Uh, power. Let's give him some power points. Two. Two's okay. It's better than one. When does this take us? Ooh. Areas with beans, I see. Chuckle bean. Oh, come on! There we go. Uh, looks good. Alright. Oh, come on. I need to get into place for this brother's block. Totally lost count of the amount of coins I got there. Oh, well. Mushroom refreshing herb and some more coins. Yeah, this part's going to be really long. Not as long as the last one was still long. And that's a dead end. I think it's about to end, though. Yeah, probably. Just this last one. This last room right here. Let's take care of this pest nut. Just quickly, right there. What? Did Luigi just, like, not cause a first strike there? That's weak. Boo, boo. There we go. Let's take care of this guy. Uh. That's what I call a first strike. See, jump before, so he's gonna bum rush me. Only the bum rushing attack he can counter. Yeah, now I can one hit KO these guys in Mario. That's cool. Uh, 
All right. Exactly 2,000 experience. That's cool. As you can see, this is much too high for us to reach. What could we possibly use? That's when the poems of love come in. And this time it has nothing to do with love. Green, be barrel man. Suddenly, B is red. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, high jump all the way up to these stairs, even though we can just normally jump up. Do some diagonal spin jump shenanigans. Green, B barrel man. Sounds like I'm saying B barrel, which is a Pokemon. Might be B barrel, I'm not sure. Anyway, did I miss anything? I don't want to miss anything. Haha, -ha, I knew it! It's a chuckle bean spot right there. Any others? They always hide them in the most... Uh, ex most unexposed areas. But that's all for this episode. On Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga Walkthrough. Bye-bye.